From the Windy City here in Chicago, Illinois, he's Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. The Blackhawks have had this portion of the schedule circled for a while. They're home for a bit, get some practice time in too. The first game of the homestand though, James, is always important because what looks like a good thing on the schedule can go south in a hurry if you play poorly and everybody gets agitated. Two teams hungry for two points, and we are ready to drop the puck. The Blues start with possession as we are now underway. Sent into the offensive zone. The Blackhawks gain control of the puck against the wall. Slides it across to Kane. Couldn't connect, although not exactly an ideal pass to begin with. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. And he handles the cross ice pass. Moves the puck. Perron's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. The Blackhawks are going to be shorthanded as they are called for tripping. Played with fire, he got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the puck and sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down and he's got to go to the box. St. Louis gets set to go to work on the power play for the first time tonight. Obviously goals have been hard to come by. Here's the first power play of the game. Chicago's won the draw and manages to clear the zone. Moves it to Schwartz. On the attack along the boards. That's a textbook save by Subban. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Loses his balance on the play. Denies him in close. And he came out and challenged him. Good save. Chicago's in a spot where you say, you're in a hole, stop digging. Just start playing better. You can't make the hole bigger by panicking. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We're still scoreless. And sneaks in and grabs possession. Gets it out of his own end. St. Louis gains a hold of the puck against the boards. And now he tries to get it across to Perron. Scooped up along the wall by DeHaan. And the puck clears the zone. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Up along the wing. The Blues gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. And he takes a shot. Blocked in traffic with the steal. And the puck leaves the zone. St. Louis has it near the wall. Moves it up. Quick pass to Tarasenko. And there's the save. The Blackhawks will try to shave a few seconds off this penalty now. Puck is cleared out of the defensive zone. The Blues have it behind the cage. O'Reilly's got it on the offensive end. Couldn't complete the play. And the puck hops onto the bench. We'll get a face off. Shen's won the face-off deep inside the offensive zone. Denies him on the slapper! And the puck is cleared to a safer spot. The Blues have it behind the net. With some open space at center. Here's a short pass to Hoffman. Gets a puddle on it to make the save! Subban's job is not just to stop the puck, but get it out of danger. He does that here. Blocked in front, and he comes up with it. And now it's grabbed by Schwartz. And it's a quick pass to Folk. And he can't hang on after that hit. Chicago's got the puck along the boards. St. Louis has it in their own zone. Slides it over with pace to Schwartz. Moves it to Krug. And now he angles it across to Hoffman. Chicago's got a hold of it against the wall. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Here he's gaining momentum. Chicago's got the puck in the corner. Oh, just wide of the net. It doesn't matter how close it is. If it's not on the net, it can't go in. Taken by Dunn. Nice pass. Pokes it away in his own end. The Blackhawks scoop it up along the boards. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Oh, wide of the net. Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. Knocked away, and he's ridden off the puck. Clifford's moving it ahead. Puck scooped up by Zadorov. Quick feed to Shaw. Shot! 
And that goes off a player in front. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Moves it quickly over to Sidora. And that banks off a stick. And he denied that opportunity. Great cross-ice pass. Bennington's been doing this all year. The team wins because he stops the puck at a high level. Wrist shot from the slot. He scores! Well, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. St. Louis draws first blood here with this opening period goal. A little bit of back and forth in the first 10 minutes of the period, James. You can get out on your front foot with a goal early. It took them midway into the period to get it, but they've got the lead now. They fight for it along the boards. Nice poke check. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Scandella. Thunderous use of the body of the hit. Takes it right in the chest. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. The Blues have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one. Nice job tying up his opponent. The Blackhawks take it along the wall. Pokes the puck away. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. The Blues will play it in their own end. Scandella's picking up steam. Centering pass. Throws it on goal. Blocker save, and he's showing up big time tonight. And now he moves it to O'Reilly. Fails to find the open man. Tries to get the puck over to Dabrinkit. The Blues gain possession along the wall. Working the puck deep inside their own end. The Blues carry it along the wall. And now it's over to Dunn. Takes the shot, and that's blocked. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. To his teammate! Nice save by the goaltender to get a pad on that. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Bumpy flares up the arm with the blocker. Makes a pretty good save here. Still lots of time left in the period. 1-0 the score. The Blues take possession off the faceoff. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. And that one's turned away. The setters will glide into the dot. Janmark's won the draw here in the offensive zone. From one point man to another. Moves it to Smith. The blocker saved by Bennington. Puck grabbed by Shaw. Here he is in close. How did he stop that one? Puck picked up by Smith. Denies him again. Quick work. He makes one and two saves in a row. The Blues have it now. St. Louis gains the zone. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Chicago's got a hold of it along the wall. St. Louis looks to attack. Drills them. Quick pass to Nylander. Chicago's moving it along the wing. Picked off in the open ice. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. Clifford's stick work will land him two minutes for slashing. That's a bad reaction. He's beat. He's out of position. He just turns around and whacks him. Just a good old-fashioned hack. Man advantage takes to the ice. It's our first opportunity to get a glance at the special teams unit. You never really know when the chance to tie a game will come. But now you've got a great opportunity on the power play. Here's a short pass to Kane. Huge stop by Bennington. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck. And a successful clearing attempt. And now it's grabbed by Dabrinkit. Long reach breaks up the momentum. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Taken by Pareko. He 
carries the puck up along the wing. Dumps it in. Chicago's got it from behind the net. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Comes up with the glove save. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. Here in the back half of this period, we've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. The Blackhawks win it. Quick feed to Yanmark. No one home on that play. Handles the puck, and he makes the save. Right up the gut, here they go. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Sends the pass over. Moves it to Yanmark. Can't catch up to the pass. Taken along the wall by Shen. That's dumped in and they'll get a fresh set of legs out on the ice. Sends it quickly to Nylander. The Blackhawks move to the offensive zone. Good use of the body on the play. Puck clear from the defensive end. Chicago's gained possession along the boards. And now he tries to get it across to Kane. Kind of lost control for a second there, but scores! That was impressive! And a bad power play can suck the life out of your team. One that looks like that and then scores a goal is a great boost. The rebound snapped away, what a nice shot. But the goalie's gotta do a better job cleaning up that rebound. You can't leave it right there. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Sunfist won the draw here in the open ice. Tries to get the puck to Clifford. The Blackhawks look to start the transition game. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. The Blues take it across the blue line. Battling for it along the boards. Now a quick pass to Pareko. Into the attacking area from the left side. Puck scooped up by Krug. Quick shot, and the lane's clogged up blocking that. Moves into the slot with the steal. Now he takes it over the line. Can't keep a hold of it. St. Louis looks to move the puck from their own end. Not able to connect. Completely misses on the play. You don't even make the goalie work here. You've got to make him have to do something in the net. St. Louis plays it against the boards. Couldn't connect on that pass. And here comes the pushback, and we've got a fight. Yeah, not surprising. These guys don't like each other. The teams don't like each other. And this is probably pretty predictable. And the crowd on their feet. They wanted it. They got it. And we might even see more. Yeah, in the rivalry game where you don't like the other team, it doesn't take much to spark a fight. I'm not so sure how everybody feels about fighting anymore, but the people that are here seem to like what they just saw. Fair to say that was a rather spirited affair on the ice. Looks like both teams have pulled their jets. And here's the upcoming faceoff. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Carpenter's got it along the boards. And he regains control of the puck. Driving right to the front. And he slides it quickly to Keith. Tape to tape feed on the blue line. The Blues have it against the wall. Trying to get back on the attack now. Tarasenko's got it in the defensive end. Picked up along the wall by Thomas. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Taves brings it in. Manages to hang on. And that's broken up. St. Louis plays it up ahead. They've got the defense outnumbered. 
One-timer denies him with a save. Battle along the boards. Puck grabbed by Kane. St. Louis has possession of it now. Flips it up the net with the stop. Big save by the goaltender once again. That's why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop. Now he's got to be sharp to make another. Keith's got the puck along the wing. And now it's to Debrinkit. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Into the offensive zone. Chicago's looking to break out of their own end. The Blackhawks will play it from the defensive zone. Nice feed at center, moves up ahead now. Strong defensive effort. Takes the feed. The Blues move it in. Shen's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. Here comes the call from the official. Zadorov's been nabbed for tripping. As soon as the hands go up when they start to bleed with the ref, you know they know they're guilty. Another chance here on the man advantage. Doesn't matter whether you've had one or ten power plays. The fundamentals of it are the same. Win the draw, get the puck to the point, try and spread the penalty killers out. They clear the zone. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. And now he angles it across to Hoffman. The Blues take it across the line. Puck picked up by Schwartz. Oh, what a blocker stop by Subban. Moves it quickly over to Hoffman. The Blackhawks gain possession of the defensive zone. Puck slid down the ice. Quick feed to Hoffman. Shen's going to play it against the half wall. Denies him! He got all of it! I want to go back to that chance we had just a moment ago. The goalie reads the play well, makes a great save on a really good scoring chance. Here in the late goings of the period, it's all tied up. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. St. Louis gains a hold of it. The Blackhawks go to work on offense. Centering pass in front, stayed by the goaltender who stayed with it on the redirect. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Swing and a miss. Couldn't find the intended target. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Shot in front. That's blocked. Quick pass to Krug. Across the point. Chicago's penalty killers get a hold of it. They move the puck out of harm's way. The Blues have it behind the net. Slides the puck across to Shen. St. Louis plays it along the wing. Here he is, shot right in front. Misses a golden opportunity there. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Power play is over, both teams back to even strength. Obviously a pretty important time in the game. The PK does a good job, keeps this game tied. That opportunity is rejected. He makes the glove stop right from the slot. That's a dangerous chance. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalie's getting the blocker up to make the save. The centermen glide into position. St. Louis with a big defensive zone faceoff. The Blues are in transition. Coughs it up on the play. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. Looks to pass it to Smith. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Well, that'll do it for period number one. Opportunities at both ends of the ice create a little bit of offense. Fun start here. Which one of your team players has the hardest shot? Who do you think is the fastest skater? We'll answer all of those questions at our skills competition. For tickets to one of the most exciting competitions this season, check our website. Both teams heading down the tunnels. We'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period. And we are just moments away from the start of period number two. 
still tied up here as we get underway here in period number two. The Blues move the puck in the defensive zone. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Passes it over to Debrinkit. Here's a short pass to Taves. Couldn't make that one happen. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Jostling for the puck and it's knocked away. Hard hit oh. on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. The Blackhawks ready to go on the attack. Here's a chance. And that's stopped by the goaltender using his head this time. Now that's got to hurt. I don't care how much equipment you have or how good the mask is. That thing's coming 80-plus miles an hour. That's got to hurt. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Kane. Loose puck battle along the boards. Slides it quickly to Hoffman. Slides the puck over. Big play inside the defensive zone. Quick feed to Dunn. Rister, and that goes wide. Hit the net. No chance to score if you don't get the puck on target. Stop that one. Clifford's on this penalty minute leaders list again. I wonder if he ever gets tired of running himself into trouble. We're still in the early stages of this period. We got a tie game. St. Louis will go to work here in the offensive end. And now he moves it to Schwartz. Makes the save. Kane's rolling along on his point streak. You know he wants it to keep going. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Thomas has won the face-off. And now it's grabbed by Falk. And they can't connect. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. The Blues win the face-off. Folks moving the puck through his own zone. And now he moves it quickly to Dunn. Takes the pass. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. Now uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box. The Blackhawks send their man advantage unit out once more. I like the way that their plan has been successful, and it's pretty obvious they're going to stay with that same mode. The Blues win the draw. Here's a chance to clear the puck from his own end. Gets it out of his own end. Chicago's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Here he is from the slot. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game. Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area and the rebound is put away. The Blackhawks go ahead by one. They had to work for that one. A lot of work put in just to get yourself inching into the lead. There's still lots of time left. Taken by Murphy. Score on the power play. Chicago's on the attack. From point blank. Oh, what a stop by Bennington. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Quick pass over to Hoffman. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Denied by the goaltender. I love making that save in road hockey, the old blocker stop. Lots of time left in this period. Chicago's been the better-looking team over the last few minutes. They'd love to build on this one-goal lead. St. Louis wins the draw, and he slides it quickly to Bortuzzo. Here's a shot. Lucky bounce for the goaltender as it goes off the inside of the iron and stays out. The Blues have been pressing here, looking to get themselves into a tie game at the very least. That one won't help, and it's the post and stays out. 
St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. Angles it over to Scandella. And that goes wide. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. And now it's grabbed by Soderberg. Gaining momentum up along the side. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Puck scooped up by Scandella. Big chest save as he gobbled that one up with the trapper. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. It's a 2-1 game. Chicago's won the faceoff. St. Louis gains a hold of possession. Gets the puck over to Thomas. And that one's picked off. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Krug's taking it from his own end. Moved up ahead after a nice pass from the right wing. Puck knocked loose in the neutral zone. Here he is in front! Deflected away, nice defensive use of the stick there. Sends one up to Strom. Chicago's got the puck against the boards. Takes the feed from the wing. Moves it to Sanford. Skates to the crease! Puck grabbed by Smith. They fight for it along the boards. The Blackhawks gain control of the puck against the wall. Solid check to slow him down. That's broken up in the neutral zone. Receives the pass. Chicago's got the puck. Sends a pass over. Hangs onto the puck. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Puck picked up by O'Reilly. Feeds it over to Perron. Quick pass to O'Reilly. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Sends it over. That's a great heads up play to break up the pass. Slides it across to Taze. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Here's a blast. St. Louis gains control of the puck. Stays with it. The Blackhawks have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Here they are on the attack. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Taken by Dunn. Carries the puck inside the neutral zone. Moves inside and puts it just wide. The goalie was late reacting. If that puck hits the net, I think it's in. Tries to feed it over to Dabrinkit. Grabbed along the board by Taves. Takes it from the right side. Moves it quickly over to Bowie. Hammers it on net. He scores while well, it rains and pours. Man, they are just coming out in buckets right now as they get three straight. Really a dominating performance. Man, the goalie's going to look at his teammates and say, is anybody going to cover the high slot? He was so open, he was able to hammer home the one-timer. Chicago's now gone up by a pair in the second. So they've got a two-goal lead. Some people say it's the worst lead in hockey. Well, guess what? I'll take the worst lead as opposed to trailing by two. Yeah, you know what's better than down by two? Being up by two, of right? Of course Simple. It is. Oh, he got paddled by Bennington. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Move to the middle. Here he is, wristed on net. Made the stop on the play. Subban's been sharp when he's had to be. He's got a good save percentage here tonight, and his team's in good shape. Bennington's taking a look up at the big board on the replay. He'll see his stick save was excellent. That was a good scoring chance. More than half the period has expired. The Blackhawks now lead by two. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Puts it in deep. Chicago's got a hold of it against the wall. St. Louis looks to attack. He was right there and they can't convert. And it's a quick pass to Pareko. The Blackhawks have it against the wall. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Jostled off the puck. He's only one goal away from his next real achievement. You know he'd like to get it here. The Blackhawks get a hold of the puck along the boards. Nice pass. Here he is in front! Oh, puts it wide! 
You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. With possession along the wall. Chicago's gained possession along the boards. Sends it in deep. St. Louis gains a hold of it. Bertuzzo stick handling in his own zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Keeps hold of the puck. Sends the pass over. Here's a short pass to Blay. Grabs control of it at the point. St. Louis will try to make something happen here in the offensive zone. The Blackhawks scoop it up along the boards. Puck dumped in and they'll complete a line change. St. Louis tries to break out from their own end. Dished on over to Scandella. Across the line from center. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Maintains possession. The Blues gain possession along the wall. Slides it over with pace to Kane. Chicago's in transition. The Blues have it from their own end. Looking for space inside the D zone. The Blues are on the attack. Chicago's got it in the neutral zone. And now it's grabbed by Kane. Wrist one in front, and that's blocked. St. Louis gets the puck near the boards. Quick feed to Scandella. Moves the puck. Tarasenko's got it against the boards. O'Reilly's on the attack in the offensive zone. Passes over to Dabrinkit. And now he tries to get it across to Strom. Chicago's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. He was locked in there. Here in the late goings of the period, the Blackhawks are up 3-1. The Blues win the draw. Moves it to Dunn. Slides the puck across to DeHaan. And they fail to go tape to tape. Puck exits the zone. Scrum ensues along the boards. From the point, they take control of it. Here's a shot, and he stands tall in goal. Man, this frame has been like roller derby. It is crash, crash, crash throughout this entire period. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Chicago's won the draw. Bowie's lugging the puck. And now it's over to Carpenter. Slides the puck across to Nylander. Right in the slot. Here he is with the backhander. Puck scooped up by Hoffman. Backtracks with possession back inside the defensive zone. Chicago's got a hold of it along the wall. Puts it on net and makes the save. The Blackhawks win the draw. Snapper from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Taken by Krug. Tries to get it to Thomas. St. Louis on the attack. Great defensive effort with the stick. Puck grabbed by Dabrinkit. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. St. Louis has the puck. Tries to get it over to Sanford. Moves it to the offensive zone. Quick pass to Kane. Tosses it on to Sidoro. And now he angles it across to Bowie. And the middle frame almost done. In the second period. Chicago's got it along the wall. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Scooped up along the wall by Clifford. With the puck inside the defensive zone. St. Louis looks to break out in their own end. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. It's been a tightly contested affair this far as the period comes to an end.
Over the Sea needs to count this month that Faybank can get access to team press conferences, practice for locker room tours. It's absolutely free, so what are you waiting for? Faybank, your team's proud exclusive banking partner. The third period is just around the corner. Ray and I will bring you all the action in a moment. Two down, one to go. Third period, they're ready to drop the puck. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go, third period is underway. Right in front with the shot, scores! They're not out of this one yet. Oh, they get one to bring themselves to within one here. Now they gotta keep the climb. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. St. Louis might be setting us up for a pretty fun finish down the stretch here, Ray. Oh, once the pressure gets on, everything becomes unpredictable. Only trailing by one, they can't take their foot off the gas. Throws it in. Chicago's going to play the puck from behind the cage. Quick pass across to Kane. Directed over to Dabrinkit. The Blackhawks played along the boards. And that one's broken up. St. Louis is across the blue line. Nothing doing on that. Moves it quickly over to Kane. Pushes it across to Keith. Handles the puck. Smart defensive play there. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. From the point, looks to make something happen. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Takes the feed. With the steal. Takes control of the puck. Feeds it to Kane. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Battle along the boards. Slides the puck over. Here's a short pass to Dunn. Takes a shot, can't get it to go. St. Louis has it near the wall. Picked up along the boards by Smith. At center ice now, he grabs the puck. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Shen's got it on the offensive end. Goes right to the crease. Kicked away, what a save. Subban so sharp on this. Reads the play, reads the puck, makes the save. And the goaltender jumps on top of that one to try to slow things down. They needed a stoppage. They started to get a little scrambly around their zone and they're looking for some help. Now they can reorganize. Subban's able to recover and he makes an unbelievable save here. That's a good chance. Lots of time left in this period. It's a one-goal hockey game. 3-2 is where we sit. Snaps it on net. Scores! On the rebound, he pops it! Followed through to the net. He picks up this rebound, makes no mistake. Once the goalie leaves the puck, in front of the net. The goalie's at your mercy, and he does not miss. The setters will glide into the dot. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Quick feed to Smith. St. Louis has possession of it now. Taken along the wall by Schwartz. Getting a little too physical to maintain possession. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Takes the pass. Putting the hard hat on here. What a hit. And that pass goes awry. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Thomas. Just wide. Chicago's got the puck along the boards. They go on the attack from the left side. Drives to the sweet spot. Stick saved by Bennington. Oh, well done by the goaltender here, James. He makes the save, but he deflects it away at the same time. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Chicago's got it in their own zone. Directs it on over to Nylander. Now a quick pass to Soderberg. 
Puts it up front and close. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. The Blackhawks will try to protect this one goal lead here now in the third. The more you do it, the more comfortable you get at it. But they've got this lead, and you want to control the pace going home. Puck picked up by Sanford. Receives the pass. St. Louis has it in the defensive end. From center, they get into the attacking area. To the front. Paddled away by Subban. Passes the puck over to Nylander. And loses possession after a solid hit. Plays the puck up ahead. Love the way he moved that puck up quickly. And that one's broken up. From the right side, they gain the zone. Here he is in close. Stopped by the goaltender. Great reflexes, another save. Moves it to Sundvist. Puck dumped in. Chicago's got a hold of it against the wall. Quick pass to Shaw. Sends a pass over. Janmark's been really quiet, James, and there's not many nights that you don't notice him. He doesn't have a goal in the game, really not many chances. They're lucky they're in the game. Bennington's able to bail his defense out here. A bad pinch at the other end of the ice leads to a two-on-one, and he makes the save. Still lots of time left in the period. The Blackhawks are looking to build on this one-goal lead. And now it's grabbed by Pareko. Sends it over to Sundqvist. Here's a short pass to play. No room for that one to get through. And now he moves it to Sundqvist. Shaw's got the puck in his own zone. Manages to hang on. The Blackhawks will play it against the boards. And the puck's not loose. St. Louis moves it quickly along the wing. Cutting to the slot. The Blackhawks gain control of the puck against the wall. Up along the wing. Moves the puck to Taves. The Blues gain possession in their own end. Scores! You get one, you get hungry for a second one. Even if you're not a goal scorer, you get that early. Now you want to hunt for a second goal. Makes it a double on the play. Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck. Los Angeles has got next here at home. Uh, not going to be an easy game. They're never that way when these two teams get together. Moves it quickly over to Perron. Slides the puck ahead to Fulk. O'Reilly's got it in the offensive zone. Loses, and he rings the post. St. Louis comes that close to making this an even closer game. Off the post it is. Denied that one. Subban's gonna slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of his game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. St. Louis wins the draw here in the offensive zone. Stones him on the one-timer. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. And now he tries to get it across to Fulk. Look out, turns it away. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. Quick feed to Fulk. Takes the feed. Chicago's looking to break out of their own end. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Picked up along the wall by Tarasenko. The Blues have it against the wall. The Blackhawks take it along the wing. Nice pass. Denies him on the play. Pennington's on top of that one for a whistle. Little bit of traffic starting to form around the net. Past the midway mark in this period. The Blackhawks holding down a 5-3 lead in what has been a fun one for hockey fans to watch tonight. Takes possession of the puck off the draw. St. Louis is on the attack. 
And he regains control of the puck. The Blackhawks will play it in their own end. Takes a hit, he goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. The Blues play it along the boards. They've got numbers. Sends it across. Let's it go. Stopped by the goaltender. Well positioned save and he has the rebound over in the corner. Grabbed along the boards by Scandella. Snaps one from the slot. That's gloved by Subban. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. The Blues still trail in this third period despite numerous scoring opportunities. Chicago's got possession here in their own end. Move to the middle! A oh chase boy. from the slot! Hey James, it's gonna circle back to that last hit. That was an enormous contact. Slides it to Carpenter. Moves it to Soderberg. The Blues get a hold of the puck along the boards. Excellent stick work on the play. Puck scooped up by Thomas. Here's a chance to set up now. Chicago's got the puck in the defensive end. Nice zone entry on the left side. Taken by Nylander. Snaps it onto the net. Flashes the leather by Bennington. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. And the teams have been going at each other since the very beginning of this hockey game. Nobody is back down. The body contact level has stayed extremely high. The centermen glide into position. Great read by the winger to take possession with the two centermen tied up. The Blues get a hold of the puck in their own end. Quick pass to play. Puck grabbed by Clifford. He takes a moment to backtrack but maintains possession. And the puck leaves the zone. Sends the pass over. The Blues take it from the side. And he slides it quickly to Krug. Scooped up along the wall by Clifford. Chicago's got control of it now from their own end. Here's a short pass to Debrinkit. Puck picked up by Pareko. St. Louis with possession in their own zone. Moves it quickly over to Perron. That pass goes a little sideways. Puck battle along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. The Blackhawks look to start the transition game. Puck sent over to Debrinkit. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Across the line. Centering pass. Oh! What a missed chance that was. Yeah, he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything right. Now you just got to get the puck on the tape. Picked up along the boards by Janmark. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Bennington. And another stop. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Chicago's got all sorts of content for the highlight shows tonight. They lead at 5-3. From the slot, fires away. Gets a pad on it to deny him. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Comes up with the stop. Moves the puck. St. Louis takes possession along the wall. Can't maintain possession. The Hans picking up steam. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. And they can't convert to the play. Denied by the goaltender. If you're going to make the save as the goalie does here, you've got to read the play and have the reflexes to execute the save. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. St. Louis has it in their own end. Looks to get the puck over to Hoffman. Nice zone entry from the middle. Good defensive effort to poke it away. St. Louis will try to make something happen here in the offensive zone. The Blackhawks are in transition. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Fires it into the offensive zone. The Blackhawks scoop it up along the boards. Quick feed to Strom. 
Chicago's across the blue line. Just a great defensive read there. Chicago's got a hold of the puck. The Blues gain possession along the wall. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. The Blues have it from their own end. Pass across to Sanford. The Blues looking against the half wall. Trailing in this one, they have pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. Chicago's looking to break out. Oh, he'd like to have that pass back. Couldn't complete the play. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Chicago's got it in their own zone. Moves it to Keith. Handles the puck. The Blues get a hold of it. Quick pass to O'Reilly. Takes the feed. Gets in front of it. Chicago's got the puck along the wall. Trying to get back on the attack now. Taken along the wall by Murphy. A chance in front! Stick save and a butte by Subban! Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. You don't want to give up too many of these during the course of the game. The odd man rush puts the goalie on alert, but he makes a good stop. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Gains control the puck here at the line. Can't find his man. Here's a short pass to Dabrinkit. The Blues will play the puck from behind the net. Here's a shot. Snaps one on that, and he hangs on just as time runs out. That's all she wrote from this one tonight. How do you chalk up a win like this here, Ray? Is this just a case of good counterpunching? Uh, yes, you could look at it like that, or you could say we're just fortunate tonight. I don't think they played very well. They didn't have the puck much. Well, a fun night here to call this one, and the fun ain't done just yet. No, they go back and salute the fans, and I'll tell you, when you're playing, you notice when it's great, you notice when it's not great. That was a great night. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.